I thought I would tell you today about the new art that I'm doing that you've seen in my gallery or will see online in my gallery. And it's my new happy place. It's called Fuse Glass. And because a lot of you are unfamiliar with the process, I thought I would show you today where I work, how I work, and the basics, the elements of putting fused glass together. Where I'm going, I'm making a sushi plate. I've got the waves put in, and I would need to cut pieces of glass to make fish. This is one that's already been completed and ready to go into the kiln. As you can see, it's not totally these all have to be glued down, and there's a couple that are loose here, but I can do that easily. But this is basically what we're talking about. That's the end result, and this is just the beginning. So what I do is I have all kinds of pieces of glass. I'm the scrap collector in this studio. I always say everybody else's scraps are my treasures. So I pick up scraps that other people have used, and I envision shapes out of them, things that could become fish, things that, shapes that could be a fin, perhaps. If I wanted to shape, um, let's take this, and we're gonna do a fin, we cut the glass, and then, hopefully this will work, perfect. We've cut a glass shape that now, as you can see in my other pieces, might be used for a fin, might be used for anything I wanted. But this is where we cut glass from, I cut glass from all these shapes. Now, once the shapes are cut, and I've kind of fit them together, as you can see here, the shapes have to be glued down with a very, this I think is diluted um, hairspray. Shapes are glued, this dries, and then they don't move. See, this one doesn't move, this one doesn't move, and these are all glued. This guy just happened to be a little loose today. So. Once the shapes are glued, they get put into the kiln and they come out, this is a very similar type piece, they come out flat and adhere to the base. The second step for this piece, once it looks like this and you can pick it up and all the pieces are fused, is to put it into the mold, put it into the kiln, this gets fired again, and it comes out with this lovely curved shape. These are palms that I worked on last week. So this flat piece of glass will be fused onto the white, and then it'll be fused again into this mold, and it will come out as a wavy plate. These are starting to move again, so we can see that I need a little more. Got it. So you want to see how it looks? 